What's up guys, it's Dalmater here, and today we are going to be reacting to a new channel. So this is Greg Owen. Uh, I'm not sure what kind of content they do, but anyway, this is Guys, Girls Like Jane Austen. Uh, isn't that the author? I I'm not 100, I know the name, I'm pretty sure she's an author. Yeah, Jane Austen, novelist. Uh, oh, she wrote Pride and, Pe and Prejudice. Okay, I've, I've never actually read that book, but I am familiar with it. Okay, so I don't know if this is going to be a comedy video or what it is, but it's a little short. Uh, so link to the original video down below. Let's jump into it. Let's start out with a happy example. Pride and motherfucking prejudice. Fellas, if you're trying to get a girl, fuck this guy. You don't need a Bugatti. Talk to that bitch about Jane Austen. <laughs> Bitches love Jane Austen. You just roll up on Shawty at the function and say, You have bewitched me, body and soul. I never wish to be parted from you from this day on. Pro tip, do this over a hard flooring surface or lay a tarp down first. <laughs> if I go ask you to dance, just be like, Your figures appear to best advantage when walking and that I might best admire them from my present position. I'm banging in the east and I'm banging in the west and I can't give you more and I will never give you less. This motherfucker is smooth with a V. <laughs> smooth with a V. Uh, I, honestly, I, I don't think I've ever, uh, maybe I should read some Jane Austen. I've never heard of, uh, this being a thing. As a woman who reads Jane Austen's complete works, uh, annually rewatches Pride and Prejudice 95 and 05. Uh, like most people watch The Office, I confirm this is accurate. Remember, the poetry will kill all but a, a stout love, but dancing encourages affection. <laughs> uh... Pride and Prejudice 2005 was a great adaptation. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen any of the Pride and Prejudice movies. I've definitely never read the books. Maybe maybe I should go down the Jane Austen rabbit hole. But, uh, yeah, every, th there's two things that I think of whenever people tell me that women like men who read. The one uh, is the meme, and it's like, women say they like men who can read, uh, but every man who actually reads is, is engaged in some form of uh, ho-scaring political extremism or something like that. I'll see if I can find the meme. Uh, it's such a funny meme. Yeah, this one. Yeah, women say they want a man who reads, but every man who seriously engages with literature is subscribed to some variety of frightening, ho-scaring political extremism. And so that's the one thing I think of. And then the other one, uh, there, there was a, a post on Twitter and it was, uh, this girl talked about how she likes guys that can read. And then some, somebody commented that like, you don't like men who can read. You like the aesthetics of an upper class wasp man reading by a fireplace at your second house on the lake somewhere in, uh, uh, somewhere in the Midwest. And it, it, it's just so funny. Cause that's, uh, the, uh, yeah, that's so true. I think when pe people think of the aesthetic so much, but you know, maybe I should read Jane Austen. Maybe that'll be uh, my next thing. I got a girlfriend anyway. I don't even. Yeah, I'd, I'd be surprised if you even know who Jane Austen was. I'll have to ask her. But anyway, let me know what you think below. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.